What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you five silly but seriously annoying things within Destiny 2. Now yes for sure, nothing here is game breaking and to be honest worth you sticking around to watch so you may as well leave now. But these are just five seriously annoying things that bug the life out of me. So expect some rage on my behalf within this video while I explain these annoying things. Also do you want to win some epic loot if so stay tuned until the very end of the video to find out more okay so patrol missions i absolutely hate patrol missions i don't do patrol missions you guys want to know why it takes weeks to start one why does it take so damn long it's so annoying it seriously is it's driven me not to do them at all things Okay, so please, for the love of all things on this earth, please Bungie, add an assign all button to shaders and a delete all button too. If I want to apply one shader to all my armors, please let me do that with the click of a button. If I want to delete all 237 crappy shaders, why the f*** do I have to go through them one by one? It takes so damn long. Please add a delete all option. Thank you. Now this one drives me around the bend. Why the f*** is the tower so damn big? Okay, so I'm fine with being overly huge, but why space out all the b vendors? I am telling you guys, 95% of the grind this game offers is running from one side of the tower to the other. Bungie must have thought it was a great idea to remove that in-game grind and add a tower into the game that is 10 times bigger than anything ever, and that would do. Between this massive tower and deleting shaders one by one, I guarantee you it's where we spend most of our time within this game. Played a thousand hours, 999 of them are f running around. Okay, so this next one boils my blood. The order tab within the vault, we have default, newest, rarity and quantity. Why the f isn't there a tab for assigning your gear in alphabetical order? This seriously pisses me off. Literally took me an hour and a half the other day deleting duplicate weapons as they were scrambled about my vault. It's a serious pain in the ass. Okay, so the final thing I'm going to moan about, and that is this. Whose wise idea was this within Bungie Studios? Someone please explain the logic behind it costing me hard-earned glimmer to apply shaders out of my inventory onto weapons and armors in my inventory. How the f*** does that work? Shaders I have spent real life money on buying bright engrams, only for me to have to go and farm glimmer to where the is. That ain't the worst part. Once a shader is applied, you can't unapply it and use it elsewhere. Once it's gone, it's gone and it's taken your glimmer and your real life money with it. But yes, where is the logic in it costing me glimmer to apply shaders out of my inventory onto items in my inventory? I already own that shader, why is it costing me any glimmer? It doesn't make sense, people! And if someone says to me anything about Grimoire, I'm likely to hunt you down and do bad things too, yeah! Grimoire and Destiny 1, maybe. Grimoire and Destiny 2, um, what's Grimoire? And on that note, guys, rant over! Thanks for stopping by and checking out the video. If you want to win some epic loot in the form of emblem codes, spiral codes and gift cards and much more, simply drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below and join my Discord server linked within the video description. Thanks as always for stopping by, sorry about the rant and I will catch you on that next one. Always in